Welcome back again guys and I'm sure you know why I'm here. Today I want to share with you one of the hottest items again in the cycling industry. I would like to say big thank you to CA Betridis Limited in Cyprus for delivering these uh, hot items to Rama Pro Cycling. So why wait? Let's go ahead and see what we got in this box. But before we go ahead and unbox this device, I would like to share with you my first impression of the general design of the whole product. I really like the combination between grey and white writing. Uh, it gives me that, you know, inspiration and excitement what's in the box. And I really like the way how they placed the front image of the device and as well as to each side of the boxing. So let's go ahead and unbox this device. I can't wait to see what's in there. And here it is, the Garmin Edge 1030 bundle. And the reason why they call it bundle because it has extra uh, accessories than the normal uh, package. So here it is. And we have in here the hard rate strap. And what I want to share with you guys when it comes to this, there is some instruction to the side of the strap, you see, and uh, really sometimes it's good to follow, you know, to see when you can wash, after how many uh, use you can wash it, and it's good to, you know, have a look around and read it, you know. And this is here, the hard rate uh, monitor. And also, as always Garmin did, they add uh, two sets of uh, uh, handlebar mount that comes uh, with the device. But what I noticed about this device uh, is they added a bit of rise into the actual uh, rubber before it used to be thinner and now they're more thicker. So perhaps for, you know, if you want to place your device onto uh, the stem, and also we have some spacers, which is that goes on your handlebar. Some handlebars, they are uh, thinner than uh, the other bars. And this is where you can use uh, this device on. As well as you've got the device protector that you can attach to the device. Uh, sometimes it's good to use it, you never know. Also, you got a set of Allen keys. There they are. You know, and another thinner spacer that goes on the handlebar. We have in here the cadence sensor. We know this from the previous design. And the speed sensor. Again, we had it in the previous uh, Garmin Edge. Okay, this is the front out mount. Uh, for the handlebar and this time I noticed that Garmin they gave some extra uh, designs or extra work into the bottom of the uh, front out and I believe this is uh, the base for the external battery that uh, Garmin came up with that allow you another 20 hours uh, extra which is good. Also in here we have the USB micro USB cable Yeah, and we have in here the uh, rubber bands for the uh, cadence sensor. They come in three sizes, dependent on the crank arm. And lastly, we have here the instruction books, so you can go ahead and see uh, how you can place, and it tells you about the strap, it tells you things uh, step by step. So the Garmin Edge 1030, here it is, and I believe Garmin, they have invested on uh, increasing the size of the screen by moving the buttons from the top into the bottom here. And that is one uh, thing different from the previous design. Uh, the power button is still at the same place into the side, and we can see 
the design comes Garmin at the front. I like the actual combination color between black and white with this uh, new uh, design. And uh, here is where the USB port, micro USB port for you to charge. And uh, really good. Now, if we look at the bag, you can see that, you know, uh, you might think that this is where the battery uh, goes, but actually in there, where uh, the micro SD card uh, goes, if you want to add uh, extra maps and uh, so on. And if you can get closer, you can see this uh, uh, gold dot in here is basically to actually connect to the external um, uh, battery that you might uh, purchase an extra and uh, use it for uh, longer rides. Yes, this is the Garmin 1030. Lovely, I like it. I can't wait to sit down and actually get into this device. So we all know this is a device of the year. So what we need to do is actually put it into use and start to use it and see the outcome of the device. In the next video, I'm gonna dive deeper uh, into the device and see the actual performance and the features that Garmin promised in the new design. I would like to add a small tip regarding safety. If you do like to do any changes into the, your device, please try to stop to the side of the road or on your time at home, uh, you know, do the changes you wanna do and then go back on your bike and ride again. From Ramo Pro Cycling, I would like to say thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.